Good afternoon, everybody. This is Dr. LaDre Webb. This will be your Better Life Blur for this week, March the 13th, 2017. It is amazing to me that we are already in the end of the first quarter in 2017. So, um, because of the way my life is set up, I wanted to share with you something I call the Law of Recharge. The Law of Recharge. It's one of those things that if you want to get away from it, no matter how you may try, you can't. If you throw a ball up in the air, the Law of Gravity says what goes up must come down. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's a spiritual law that says you reap whatever you sow. Uh, and so I, I believe in sharing this law of the recharge. Um, why is that important? Because all of the energy that you expend out, all of the energy that you use has to be replaced. And that's not just for your body. That's the easy part. But also for your mind. Also for your relationships. Also for your finances. Also for your career. Every area of life, and there are seven of them, that you expend energy, you have to take time to replenish that energy. So, I believe there are two types of recharges. The first one I call a minor recharge or the external recharge. It's usually limited to the body. We kind of do it every day consistently. Uh, you know, you take a nap, recharge. You go to bed early, recharge. That's really pretty easy to do. Uh, my mother taught me a cleaning principle that is so true and it still works today. She said, if you do the maintenance cleaning consistently, then you only have to do the major cleaning sporadically. And that's the principle behind this law of the recharge. If you are consistently taking a nap, taking a breather break every day, then you push back when you have to go away on vacation to recharge your physical body. You push back when you have to go to the spa to, to recharge your physical body. You push that back because you're doing the consistent maintenance. However, the time comes at your need and at your desire where you have to do what I call the internal recharge. This is where you literally shut off from all of the things that are going on in this world. You shut off from all of the drama and you focus back on you to make sure that things are going right for you. So you may take a weekend to go to the mountains and unplug your cell phone to make sure that you're still on track for your goals. You may take a week to make sure that you're still on track with your relationships. You may take, take a weekend to make sure you're still on track with your career advancement. It doesn't matter how you make it happen. It doesn't matter what it looks like. But you have to have these minor recharges, kind of a daily thing. But you've also got to have these major recharges. Some people recharge monthly. Some people recharge quarterly. Some people recharge twice a year. Some some people do a major recharge once a year, but they do smaller recharges along the way. Don't get stuck on the on the technicality and the language or the semantics behind it. You've got to do the little daily recharges or the regular recharges, and you've got to schedule those deeper recharges that will cause you to be rejuvenated. This past weekend, I went to a con convention uh, for my legal shield business. That's why I've got my shirt on, because I remind myself that change starts with me. Yes, I remind myself. But that conference was a chance for me to get away to recharge my entrepreneur battery. It was a chance to do some maintenance to my entrepreneur thinking so that I can continue to become the business owner that I am so that I can employ others and make my mark in the earth for the rest of somebody's life beyond me. But because I took, took time away to go and get recharged in my career or what I do for money, that gives me the fuel to run harder, run faster. And you've got to do these minor recharges and these major recharges in every area of your life. If you do that, you will soon find out that life is good, but a better life is best. This is Dr. LaDre Weathersby, your Better Life Coach. Blessings to you. Look forward to talking to you soon.